New trail encircling the entire Denver metro area is now open. Perfect time if you want to get outside this weekend and enjoy it. Joining us live this morning to talk about all of it is designer of the trail, Michael Torme. Michael, good morning. Thanks for being here with us. Oh, there we go. Now you can hear you. Um, kind of tell us, tell us about the trail. Yeah, so I'm, I'm uh, here to share the news about the Denver Orbital Trail. It's a brand new 177 mile, 28 segment walking, hiking and biking route that totally encircles uh, the Denver metro region. Oh, it looks cool. So we've got a picture of it up right now. You can kind of see it goes all the way around the Denver area. No, no, Michael, we talked just a little bit ago and you said you've actually walked the entire thing. Yeah, that's correct. I've walked every inch of uh, all 177 miles. I didn't do it in one go, of course. It took me took me several months and several weekends. But, you know, something that kind of really struck me as I went about it is every single segment of the 28 segments is different. There's something really amazing and interesting to discover and really says something about, you know, the incredible trails network we have here in Denver that, you know, one, you can make a circle and two, you can discover just so much as, as you go around the circle. Now, what was your inspiration behind this trail? Yeah, you know, I you know, I used to live in the UK and I, I actually worked for two different walking organizations over there. And so, you know, I, I have I have experience building and designing trails. And when I moved to Denver, I was so inspired by this incredible network of existing paths and greenways all over the metro region region. And frankly, one night I was just kind of playing around looking for a hike to walk for that weekend. And you know, my, my mind started going wild. I started dreaming bigger and bigger and bigger until I realized that this, you know, was a thing you could do. You could draw a full circle around the region. And that really got me really inspired. There's something really cool about being able to start in one place and, you know, come back to where you started 177 miles later, but having seen so much along the way. Now, how do people access the trail? I know you said there's kind of like different entry and exit parts. Not only that, but is it for bikers and walkers and runners? Kind of talk about all that. Yeah, yeah, great question. So the Denver Orbital Trail, each segment, uh, the start and the end point for all 28 segments has at least a parking lot. Most of them have uh, transit access um, via RTD as well. And then the physical, you know, kind of access to the trail, a lot of it is paved, uh, kind of the vast majority of it is paved because of our high quality greenways we already have throughout Denver. So it's really suitable for anyone trying to walk it, bike it, run it, you know, even, you know, walk your dog on it. Even, you don't even have to do a full segment. This is just a new way to kind of start discovering some new trails and, and see what's out in the region and, and just, you know, hopefully discover something new about, about this really incredible place we live. Thank you, Michael. Is there any other, any other information you would share with us about this, this big old trail around Denver? Mm -hmm. Yeah, thanks. I encourage people to check out our website. It's denverorbital.org. We're also on uh, Twitter and Instagram. And really just encourage people to get out. Walk one segment, walk all 28. You know, it's up to you. But um, however much you do, however much you dot, there's something to discover along the way. All right. Well, thank you so much, Michael. We appreciate you being with us, with us here this morning. Thanks so much. Uh -huh.